Democracy gives us the right to agree and disagree. In fact, disagreement is the foundation of democracy. However, what we heard from Johanna Nieno and Oscar Sudi yesterday was not a disagreement with President Uhuru Kenyatta. It was a personal attack and an insult to not only the president, but also members of, her, of his family, more so his mother. Even if Sudi does not respect the president, he should at least respect the president's family, most of all, his mother, Mamangena Kenyatta. Kenyans at a committee, we are very keenly observing what is happening. And we can tell Kenyans, wherever they are, that uh, Kenya cannot repeat those histories that we have repeated before. Let us be measured in what we do. Let us be measured in what we say. And of course, as a committee, I think uh, we've started liberation, deliberations on uh, the possibility of tightening the penalty regime around uh, words which can incite ethnic tensions and, and what we call generally hate speech. That they must stop the reckless utterances, because when they give those reckless utterances, they influence the thinking of their followers. Under no circumstance will we allow this country to go to the dogs because of the leaders of this country. It doesn't matter what party you come from. It doesn't matter what ethnic background you come from. It doesn't matter what social background you come from. You must adhere to the law and you must ensure that we uphold the security of this country. Our mothers and our fathers are gifts from God and they must be respected, irrespective of your social status. I'm sure even you, people of the fourth estate, you would want your parents to be respected. So let's not really, as leaders, get to that level where we do things which even a normal person is not expected to do.